Hey everyone, it's Kai again, and today I wanted to share something with you all that was pretty interesting that I was able to get my hands on. So this here is a cassette version of the very first Wang Chung album called Wang Chung, back when the band was still called Wang Chung. When the band was first formed, they went under the name Wang Chung, as opposed to what they would go on to be named Wang Chung. And they made the change because the record label thought that with a name like this, people wouldn't be able to pronounce it correctly, and it would make the band more inaccessible. They had a couple of really big hits, like Dance Hall Days is probably their biggest hit, and then they had another song later in the 80s that got popular, Everybody Have Fun Tonight. But yeah, you probably would recognize them if you look it up, if you just want to do that. Yeah, anyway, this is a pretty rare cassette version of the album. I was only able to find two cassette versions in total online, and they were both this Italian issue of the cassette, which, to be honest, it kind of looks like a bootleg because music A, I have no idea what that is. It could just have something to do with Arista or Arista or something. The fact of the matter is I was able to obtain it, and this is the cheaper of the two. It was like $22, and the other one was 45 But yeah, I, I'm glad I was able to get this sealed, but part of me is going to feel bad when I open this because it's like kind of ruining a piece of history. Like, I presume that this cassette has been sealed for like 39 years, which is when the album first was released. In reality, I'm kind of preserving a piece of history because I'm going to eventually make a cassette rip of this with my new Sony cassette player that I acquired that is the best cassette player I've ever owned, but I know that it's not really the best cassette player I could own. I don't know, you'll see how it sounds. I'm gonna post a cassette rip of this, assuming that no copyright issues arise. Let's get into opening this, I guess. An interesting note is that uh, on the back, Dance Hall Days is misspelled. I'm pretty sure that's how you spell dance in German, D-A-N-S-E. This sticker back here probably just is noting that it cost 9 euros 99. It was only 8,000 issues, and this is the second one ever made. Like, I don't know if that's what that actually means, but if it is true, I'd be pretty delighted because this is definitely a rare cassette. But anyways, let's open it up. I'm gonna try to be gentle because I want to keep the stickers on the back intact. Comes off nice and easy. And then you have the little other pieces of the plastic. So here it is. Very good condition. There's just a little tiny scratch here, and considering that it came from uh, Madrid to my home in the United States. I'd say it did pretty well. Something interesting is on the side here. I don't know if you can see that. There's like a some sort of symbol. I don't know if it's supposed to be like a Chinese thing or if it's even supposed to be there in the first place, but um, I don't know, it's there. But yeah, let's open this up. Wow, that is a very old looking cassette, which I guess is fitting because this is from the early 1980s. But yeah, you can see the track list. For fans of this band, uh, you might be disappointed to know that it does not have that track uh, Tina Na on it. Instead, it has uh, Dance Hall Days, the 1982 version of it, which I on honestly prefer. I mean, I like the early 80s sound better than I like the, uh, the one from sort of mid-80s that actually took off. I'm really excited to see what this sounds like. Hopefully it's not like the worst recording ever. It probably isn't. There's some sort of symbol on the tape itself. I honestly don't know what it is. It looks like a semicircle and like a, a circle with like quarter of it missing and then another one that's facing the other way. I don't know if that's supposed to be some sort of logo or something, but I don't know, it's there. But yeah, uh, enough of listening to me ramble about this. Uh, stay tuned for a cassette rip of it, and I hope you all have a great day. Thanks for watching.